This is the editor, and in Bubble, we have seven tabs to help you build your app. Design for defining your app's visual appearance. Workflows for defining user interaction. Data for managing data your users create. Styles for creating reusable designs. Plugins for adding extended functionality. Settings to define app-wide controls and connect to external services with one click and logs for monitoring our app's usage and activity. Bubble is a visual programming language and a hosting provider, meaning your application is running the second you create it. To see your application running, hit Preview. Bubble has two modes, Development Mode and Live Mode. Live Mode is what your users use, and Development Mode is what you use to test what you're building without impacting your live app. This is your Development Mode Preview as noted by version test in your URL. It's also called run mode because you're previewing your application running. When you make an update to anything, Bubble will auto save and run mode will notify you to refresh to see the changes. When you are ready to publish what you're working on in development mode, drop down the development tab and click deploy current version to live. Fill out a description of what this deploy contains so if you ever wanted to revert back, you know which to revert to. Once deployed, switch from development mode to live mode like so. Live mode is read only, so you can only make changes to your app in development mode. But when you hit preview, you will see your app running in live mode without version test next to it. This live application lives on your app name followed by .bubbleapps.io, which you can then share for all to see or add your own domain to it. Now that we've previewed our application, it's time to see how easy Bubble makes it for you to put an interface like this together.